Richard Atwood, you're about to drive up the hill in the 917. Uh, are, are you excited or do you get excited anymore? <laughs> <laughs> I think the adrenaline will rush anyway. I mean, it may not be apparent, but it does because you're getting into a car that you need to be serious and uh, you can make a mistake. And so, yeah, so I've done it lots of times here and uh, I love coming to the Festival of Speed. And uh, I mean, the museum car this time, which uh, is going to perform just as well as my car would have done. You've just come out the car, down from the hill, looked and sounded fantastic. How was it for you? It went well. I, I haven't driven the 917 until now, and um, it's like an old coat that you put on again, and it's, uh, it was fantastic. Yeah, they, they sound fantastic, of course. So uh, that was part of it, most of its charm to me. What's the car like to drive up there? Is it a handful? Is it, is it easy to drive? No, like, like all the stories of, of the 917, the early ones were really not sorted out. And then once they developed it, they were fine, and they drive like an ordinary race car. I mean, it's quick, but it's uh, very manageable, the balance is good, everything, everything works on it. So it's a perfect car to drive in 24 hours. Thanks very much. As I say, it looked and sounded fantastic. Great to have a chat with you and have a great weekend. Thank you. Okay. Right, Gordon. Thanks, Richard. Thank you.